So from a phenomenal Wattpad series to Viva One hip series to Ken TV, the stars of Rain España, Kevin Perlejo and Marco Galio. Hi guys! Hi. Thank you for choosing to visit Davao. Of course, sabi na lang kasi sobrang ganda daw and sobrang pain sa mga tao. Yes! And so, we were so excited when we found out na talagang Davao na. Yay! Love it! Ano yung like reaction ninyo seeing each other again after so long? Kasi parang the last time we saw you together was in PDD pa and then now you like super grown up na. Iba na yung like uh, career packaging ninyo. Of course, I was like super surprised because it's been a long time since nakita kami, and I don't think we ended in a good note. I just know na antagal kung hindi na siya nakita, so hindi ko na siya kilala. So I don't know kung ano yung expect ko sa bagong Marco or like sa Marco na mature na yun. And I'm loving it. So what made you say yes, ba to accept? This project. Why would I say no, right? Um, I got the project and I thought it was gonna be just like any other project, you know, something that I would just do and it would be done in a couple of months and I would move on to the next one. Um, I didn't really realize what I was getting myself into and I think both of us, right? Mm -hmm. We didn't see that. No. Yeah, I auditioned for the uh, for the role. Oh, you really auditioned? I did. I was actually nasa lock in ako na na nahimik ang gabi at the time. So when they gave me the script, medyo hindi pa ako super focused sa script na yon. Um, they said it's something big, and so para ako you know what? I'll do my best. Although nung time na yon, sobrang pangit din ang internet connection. So hindi siya smooth um, Zoom audition. And so nakakagulat lang din na natanggap din ako nung time na yon. I think it's it's God's perfect timing. God's perfect. Paano yung naging tawid, especially to you heaven? Kasi yung nananahimik ang gabi, like you are, you're kalabing that time was Ian. Mm -mm. And then, ano yung like naging tawid ng character from there to now here in Rinas in Espanya? Yes, so sobrang layo. Sobrang layo nung both characters na ginampanan ko. Um, good thing na lang kasi may workshop kami before taping day. So, nakapag-warm up naman na and nagkaroon din kami ng bonding with the cast. So, noong time na yun, close na kami before starting the show mismo. So, it, it was really a big help for me to like, to change my character. Because I don't want also na parang maging same naman ang character all the time. I wanna be versatile. Yes. What's the hardest part naman in like filming this series? Or meron ba sa inyong dalawa? Like siguro may dumaan ba kayo sa like awkward stage since you are parang starting to get to know each other again? Parang kapaan mo na may mga ganong factors pa sa inyo? Ang Luna kasi sobrang energetic niya 100% ako yes. niya. And sometimes ako, meron akong 50% like introvert. And so, minsan lumalabas yun, like, I'm, I just get tired easily. And so, minsan nakikita niya yung mood swings na yun. Um, at first, I think nagkaroon ng miscommunication. At first. <laughs> like, of course, like, baka meron ka lang, you know, like, another judgment. But then when oh, he, okay. yeah, but then when he parang finally understood to me, parang dun niya na-realize, ah, okay, ganyan pala. And so, like, he's always the one who's helping me, um, you know, lift my mood up, or like when it comes to health, also. So, you, you, the whole the rain in Espana, although it's kind of hard because of the time and you know, like the scenes, emotional drama and the rain. Um, he was there with me all the time, even also the university girls and the boys. The kakatulungan lahat. Which, yeah. I think that struggle made yeah. us closer in a way because we were going through it together. Yeah, so you know, nakakatuwa, although my struggle. But, you know, sabi ni Marco, like, we're closer now. And that reflect talaga siya sa series, like per episode, ang ganda ng chemistry, not just kayong dalawa, but really the entire team. So, and, and dun talaga yung teamwork. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, kung baga, worth it ang lahat ng sacrifices, yung mga rain moments, and how many yeah. retakes. Pero, what kind of values ba? ang gustong, gusto ninyong ma-impart sa mga audience, especially siguro the younger generation. You know, I actually thought about it, and the kind of love that Kalex and Luna have for each other, it's, I think nowadays, 
especially the younger ones, they, they always find reasons or let's say red flags for people to like give up so quickly. When like, I, I don't believe soulmates are, you know, found, found. Like you have to work on it. You can't just give up in the first obstacles that you will encounter, right? You, you have to like work on it. You have to, <laughs> what, right? I don't want to be. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> You don't agree, do you agree? No, I do agree with you. Okay. Yeah, yeah, right? And I feel like <laughs> people nowadays break up so easily when when you shouldn't. Yeah. I also think that the important values also from the in Spain. Communication. Mm -hmm. Communication is definitely the key. If only Luna have heard his side of story, maybe things would be different. But I guess like, you know, everything happens for a reason at some point. And siguro yung nga kung meant to be talaga kayo sa isang tasa, um, babalik at babalik kayo sa isang tasa. Kahit abutin niya ng seven years, ten years. Uh -huh. If you are really meant for each other, the universe will really make it possible. <laughs> did, honestly, did you expect ba na like magiging ganito kahingan yung pagtanggap sa series and sa inyo as a love team? Ooh, definitely not for me. No, I mean, I always had this um, kind of thought, I don't know if you agree with this, but I had this thought where since it was already big in itself, it already had a, a fandom base, uh, based by the book, um, I always had this fear where I kind of thought that it was either going to be a big thing or either is going to be a flop. Because that's how it is when you reenact um, stuff from the books, right? So it, it's either people are really gonna like it or people are not gonna like it at all. Mm -hmm. It was one of the two. It was literally black and white for me. Yeah, ako naman. Um, nung una, hindi ko talaga alam during workshops. Hindi ko talaga alam. Pero nung nag press con kami, as in bigla booms yung Twitter sobrang ingay, yes, like trending yeah, agad. Pero ah, like kada yung mga fanbase nito, mm -hmm. book na talaga yun ba? And so like the pressure was on. And <laughs> so but the thing na first day para kami. Okay, guys, let's do our best. Ganon. So, parang mas lagi, lalo na kami naging meticulous for the things sa lines, paano, pin, paano dinescribe si Luna, or yung per character, yung mga suot na lang sing -sing, mga continuity for other books, dapat yeah. nandun na rin sa first book pa lang. I believe not because you are afraid to be bashed, but to really give just to the character yeah. na, na in love yung mga tao dun sa character. As a matter of fact, I think the bashing even pushed us to do even better. Because it's like, you know, we, we don't want to be bashed. So it's like, the only thing we could do to answer that is literally just give our best. Right? Yeah. Yes, so ito na, para hindi na ko palalampasin ng mga uh, fans ninyo here in Davao kung hindi ko ito itatanong. Uh, ano ba daw ang real score between Marco and Kevin? I think sa first part pa lang na interview, nasagot na yung tanong na yan. Tama na sa Because the way you look at each other. <laughs> yeah! Okay, <laughs> next question! Okay, so what, what, okay. Do we, what do we say to this? Three, two, two one, two! two. Personal! <laughs> Alright, so now let's invite your fans to first download the Viva One app and mababanood na ang Rain in Espanya sa TV5! Yes! Hey guys! So, I think bitahan po namin kayo ang manood ang The Rain in Espanya. Available na po yan sa Viva One app. You can download it on iOS. If you're an iOS user, Android user, search mo lang ang Viva One. And mabilis na yan. Mag-log in ka na, subscribe ka na, 99 pesos lang for one month. Pag gusto mo naman ng one year, 9.49. Am I right? And so, mapapanood mo na ang buong The Rain in Espanya. Pag, pagkatapos mo, iiyak, tatawa, at kikiligyan ka. Yes, and watch out also The Rain in Espanya on TV5. So, sa mga nakamiss siguro sa Viva One or gustong ulit-ulitin or experience it on TV, mapapanood na ninyo ang Rain in Espanya sa TV5. So, every uh, Sunday, yes, 4 every, p.m. Every Sunday, 4 p.m. We really, really do appreciate from the bottom of our heart uh, every single like support that you guys did from the very start. And uh, I think me personally, uh, I want to ask the same support for the following books as well. Um, just because I think 
everyone else deserves the same chance we did. Um, yes. Ako gusto ko na magpasalamat sa lahat ng mga bumibili ng books until now. Yeah. And also sa lahat ng mga edits, sa lahat ng mga tags ninyo sa amin. Nakikita ko po yun. Nakikita namin lahat yun. So maraming maraming salamat. Na-appreciate ko po lahat ng effort at pagmamahal ninyo kahit through online world love. Um, it means a lot to us. Yep. Thank you so much, you guys. Thank you so much, guys. And looking forward to seeing more of you on your future projects. And guys, let's be inspired with their characters. Sa Reina Espanya, so always the communication, the teamwork, and kung may gusto kang sabihin sa tao may namahal mo, go and say it. This is the sign. This is the sign. So thank you so much, Marco and Heaven. Thank you so much, Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Thank you.